Hello Trio Fuses, my name is James and a lot has been released about Trio Overworld since my last video. So I thought today I'd make a list of my top 5 unique items that are being introduced to Overworld that are actually brand new to the franchise. So today I'm going to be counting down this list in no particular order just to highlight some of the amazing things that have been shown and just to get you a little bit excited about this game as it has just been announced that PS4 and Xbox One as well as PC and should be launching at some point this year. So with that in mind, let's begin. Five. Now in the number 5 slot is a space biome. One of the most requested things during the development of Terraria was a space biome because a lot of people were reaching the top of the world and they had nothing to really steer at. So the people behind Terraria Overworld have combated this with a nice little meteorite setting that is the space biome. This one was actually shown in one of the trailers for the music and I really like the music and the whole aesthetic that goes with it. I do hope that it gets fleshed out with a few enemies though. Four. Now in the number 4 slot is NPC Improvements. So one of the NPC improvements that's been implemented into Terraria Overworld is that NPCs will now talk about items in the background. Now this is a great feature because what it does is it makes the world a little bit more immersive. It really sucks you into the fact that the NPC are actually living there and are affected by the world and it also helps with the overarching story that runs through Terraria Overworld. Three. Now in the number 3 slot, Terraria Overworld has a tower defense game built straight into the game. Now this is all about fighting off the corruption or the crimson no matter what variant it's going to be. And what this allows you to do is you have these towers that you can then upgrade. So you can upgrade such things as the health of the tower, the defense of the tower, and then you can also assign a few different variables that do different things. So in one of the screenshots it actually showed that the player equipped three random items. Now it's not known to the public what these items will do, however we can tell that this will be a way to differentiate towers from other towers. Two. Now in the number 2 slot is a revamped crafting system. Now this crafting system works a lot better from the scroll and search version of Terraria because this version actually has an actual menu and everything is organised into tabs. So you'll have one tab for armour, one for weapons, one for tabletops and one for kitchen sinks. But the good thing about this is, is you can actually favourite certain items that you craft and then you can go to a favourites tab and you can craft these much quicker. So if you're a player that wants to use a lot of arrows on the go, what you can actually do is you can craft them a lot, lot quicker than you could before. Now this will only save you a few seconds, but then few seconds over the whole game will make this game seem a lot smoother. One. Now in the number one slot is a quest system from the start of the game. Now why this is good is that it will allow new players to transition into the game in a much smoother fashion than Terraria. One of the main issues with Terraria is that people would jump into the game, not know what to do and then leave and never come back. But with Terraria Overworld, if you get the player invested in a questing system right from the start and hold their hand just a little bit, they may stick it out with the rest of the game and we can build a stronger community. Hopefully there won't be too many fetch quests though because that would ruin it. So that's been about it for today's top 5 list. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed hearing about Terraria Overworld. I know I'm really excited, especially with the release on PS4 and Xbox One, as well as PC and some of the older consoles. It makes me really, really happy to be a Terraria fan right now, and hopefully it makes you happy too. So if you've not clicked that subscribe button, make sure to do so. What it does is it tells YouTube that you want to see more stuff like this. Chippy Gaming is the one-stop place for all things Terraria, including Terraria Overworld, and we welcome everyone that's new. So thank you for watching. My name is James. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.